Hi everybody and welcome back to Hex Token Channel. Hope you guys are having a blast out there. Hex.com, let's go. What is it? Day number 841 in the Hex journey. So that's 841 days so far. And of course the 22nd of March 2022. They got the price down uh 1.9% to 11 and just 11.46 cents. So uh, cool, cool. Let's jump over to the results. And of course, uh, return on investment multiplier from all time low, 5th of January 2020 uh, is a 2031X that excludes staking. So look at the T share numbers uh, under six today. Uh, that's a bit of a shock after the last two epic days. Uh, 5.959, but that's awesome, right? So very, very cool. T-share price is 2,423. As I say, good time to dollar cost average because if hex goes back to its all-time high, uh, this will be like $12,000 or something. Uh, T-share rate, 21,140, and it's up 9.1. Uh, have we had, yeah, increases in the T-share rate every single day? It's only getting more expensive to get a, a, a T-share uh, for a one-day stake at least. So uh, just remember that. Longer pays better, of course. Uh, average stake length, 6.37 years, and same as yesterday. Annual percentage yield rate uh, int uh, interest, or as we like to call it, inflation and early end state penalties, 37.67%. Liquidity in the pool, 177.5 million hex and 17.1 million US dollars and 1737 Ethereum. Let's jump over to the uh, lock valuations, 7.09 billion, uh, market cap 66.1 billion, and of course, uh, T share market cap uh, 25.93 billion. Uh, T shares down slightly, 493, and of course, uh, we're under 10.7 million T shares. Uh, supply numbers we've got uh, inflation pretty low today, minted 9.2 million hex, and of course, uh, uh, total supply is 639.1 billion hex. Now, remember, inflation is pretty low here, and uh, we have uh, we're going to talk about that later in today's live show. So, you catch us on that. We're going to talk about uh, hex inflation and how that works. Cool, cool. Let's get into a circulating supply. 577.3 billion, and that is down 11 million. That's good to see. And staking up 20 and a half million. That's good to see. 61.8 billion. Of course, we like to see these kind of uh, uh, flows because that's kind of uh, the way that X should work. Very, very cool. We've got good accounting here, down 2.2 million, and a stake percentage of coins, 9.67% of all coins are stakes. So cool. Let's jump over to the uh, payout. We've got 63.7 million X is paid out. You know, this is uh, deferred inflation into the future. And penalties today, very low, 253,000 compared to the previous two days when we had that good accounting. Very, very cool. Total holders, of course, 473,605, up 269. And a stake is up 122 to 88,567. Uh, total stake is up 143 to 111,052. And uh, finally, current holders up 89 to 286,865. This results for date, uh, at day 841, folks. And of course, uh, let's get on to the next one. We're going to go to the price of X. We can see that we've got our big uh, formation here. We are 11.46 cents. So that's where we are today. Uh, the high uh, 11.66, low 11.3. Uh, so we're somewhere in the middle there uh, waiting for this to make a decision about where we are. We've got a close, uh, the bond bands are getting a bit sh more shallow. Uh, so we'll see where this heads in the next uh, few days. Uh, trying to get into that 12 and a half to 14 cent range for sure uh, would be pretty cool. Let's jump over to uh, the T share rate at the moment. 2,428 is the live price. We've got 60% of uh, liquidity in version three uh, pool. And uh, hey, we just got a refresh there, going pretty good. We've got uh, obviously a good time to DCA into the T shares. Uh, the T share price adoption is up and to the right. And of course, we'll supercharge when Pulse Chain comes. Uh, a T share rate is up and to the right, and that's accelerating. Man, oh, man, oh, man, that's catching a lot of people off guard, especially the short-term OG stakers. Uh, maybe they should start th thinking about staking out uh, a couple of years, uh, uh, max out those returns. Uh, daily payout per T-share is uh, awesome as well. Look at all these above-average returns here. It's spectacular. And, of course, let's have a look at all the global stakes here of everybody staking. We're going to zoom on the next 11 months. And, of course, uh, we can see uh, that uh, there is not too many T-shares coming out. Uh, 78,000 coming out at the end of March. Next few days, and of course, uh, end of April uh, is 335,000 T-shares. As I say, this is starting to break up more and more. As we move in time, uh, these stakes start to break up more and more and more. So uh, very, very cool. Uh, good chance. Uh, my earliest expectation of launch is currently the 18th of April. Uh, so, so we have we see how we go there. Uh, there's not a lot to do. We'll see whether we actually launch with V3 uh, harvesting or whether we, we just go. 
uh, once uh, the test net is happy and up and running. We'll see how we get on with that. But uh, that's where we are, the folks. Hope you enjoyed that. Feel free to subscribe, like, share, hit the bell. And, of course, uh, if you want to become a member, hit the join button. We've got Polskins, Hexkins, and Richard Art Club. Uh, finally, uh, catch me in the live show today. Uh, we're going to have some interesting topics today. Uh, we're going to be really mixing it up over the next few days. So I hope you enjoy that for sure. All right, bye for now.